tried to find, you know, some some natural explanation, mm-hmm. reflection, uh, or an aerostat balloon for weathers. No, I, I sent a personal friend down there. He thought I was crazy. I said, hey, do me a favor. Go down there. You just a regular digital camera. See what you see. We have that. that. And Roger, what, how long ago did that? Did they take that picture? Well, so those were sent to me by my friend John Ardwood. I sent another guy down because I wanted to be absolutely sure. I'm not interested in embarrassing anybody here. No. Don't despise myself. Uh, but the, these pictures are only several weeks old. Okay, uh, so while you're talking, uh, Emily has, we have three of them from you. There's only a couple weeks old, several weeks old, you said. And remember what we just showed you a few minutes ago is months old, three or four months at least. Yeah. So Emily, while you're talking, Roger, show those three photos that your friends took. There is that there. circular thing. There you can see it. Uh, it's very, very clear. Uh, it doesn't move. Day or night, it's harder to see during the day, but you you see it at night. Uh, and uh, I'm absolutely convinced uh, about the inherent. There it is again, about the inherent evil of what's going on in the White House, what's going on in the country. And I think it's imperative uh, that people know about this, that people of good faith, that Christians know about this, and we begin uh, a national essentially a prayer assault to close the portal. That's good. Now, there's one during the day that it's harder to see. But that's yeah, but you can see it. It's, it's there. It's right there above the White House. So it's always above that gable. You notice yeah. that? Oh, it's it right is. above the gable. It is. Now, Roger, I didn't mean to interrupt you, but you're talking about prayer. That it needs we prayer. have to close the portal. That's what this is about. We now, as Christians, our obligation is to close the portal, which is to essentially to drive Satan away. Uh, I can tell you in my own life, uh, since my redemption, uh, first of all, on Saturdays, I march on abortion clinics with others. Uh, on Sundays, wow. I travel a lot, uh, but I, I try to speak at a different church. I try to witness to the Lord in a different wow. church. Uh, I've met many great friends. Satan conti- continues to try to put temptation in my path mm-hmm. there's, there's zero chance zero chance I, i'm a man on a mission now 